welcome back in this video we'll be discussing about this topic radiosity so we'll be seeing what is radiosity consider a surface this surface is gray diffuse and opaque surface diffuse surface already are not know, uh, knowing uh, the surface whose properties are independent of direction is diffuse surface and opaque surface means the transmittivity it is not transmitting any incident radiation whose transmittivity tau equal to 0 and then you know that the absorptivity plus reflectivity will be equal to 1 and this surface is also gray in radiation by gray surface you mean that properties are independent of wavelength also so for this surface properties are independent of wavelength properties are independent of direction and the transmittivity will be equal to 0 and on such a surface an amount of energy is incidenting and that the incident energy per unit area will be known as irradiation we will be representing it by capital G and out of this radiation nothing will be transmitted then something will be absorbed and something will be reflected if the reflectivity is represented by rho then reflected energy will be equal to rho into G and also this surface will be at some temperature so it will be able to radiate and the amount of energy radiated if it is a real body will be represented by E. So the net energy which is coming out from the surface is emitted energy E and also the reflected part of irradiation that is rho times G is coming. And this total energy which is coming from a surface is known as radiosity. So it is defined as the total radiant energy leaving a surface per unit area per unit time is known as radiosity. So J can be equated to rho times g radiation plus the emissive power of this body and you know that if at this if a body is at the same temperature which is black then its emissive power is eb and for a real body e can be written as the emissivity of that body into eb epsilon into eb you can write and again since this surface is opaque tau equal to zero then remaining things are absorptivity and reflectivity only then you can write from this expression you can write the reflectivity equal to 1 minus alpha and also from the previous Kirchhoff law you are knowing that uh, for all bodies the absorptivity will be equal to emissivity so you can write alpha as epsilon so you will be reconsidering this radiosity j which is equal to 1 instead of rho i can write 1 minus alpha alpha is equal to epsilon so it will be 1 minus epsilon into g plus for an emissive power of this body i can write it as emissivity of that body into the emissive power of a black body at the same temperature so this is about radiosity next you will be seeing for such a surface what is the net energy exchange so here we will be seeing the net radiant energy leaving the surface see this is net we are calculating so here we know that uh, radiosity are known knowing and irradiation also knowing suppose this surface is gray uh, gray uh, and it is uh, opaque and it is also diffuse in nature and it if it is having a surface area of a we are considering now we will be finding the radiation is g then total energy coming or total energy incident you can calculate so total energy incident will be equal to g into a and radiosity is the total energy leaving the surface so total energy leaving the surface also you can calculate leaving the surface will be equal to radiosity is per unit area so radiosity into area you can calculate so these are total from this you will be calculating the net energy net radiant energy leaving the surface so net radiant energy leaving the surface you can calculate which is equal to net total energy leaving minus total energy incident that is from this you can calculate uh, take j minus g into a as common now you know that j is equal to rho g plus e which is from this previous expression you are now having j equal to 1 minus epsilon into g plus epsilon uh, into eb so here this will be equal to 1 minus epsilon into g plus 
epsilon into eb from this i will be writing an expression for irradiation g so g will be equal to j minus epsilon into eb divided by 1 minus epsilon i will be getting so this one i will be substituting onto this expression which is net energy leaving so it is net energy leaving or net energy exchange from the surface will be equal to j minus instead of g i can write this expression which is j minus epsilon into eb divided by 1 minus epsilon and whole into a if you are simplifying then you will be getting this as epsilon into eb minus j divided by 1 minus epsilon into a this expression you will be getting for the net energy that is leaving the surface uh, next we will be seeing what if it is a black surface if it is a black body or black surface see if black if body is black then its uh, emissivity is 1 then you will be getting 1 minus 1 0 infinity you will be getting so uh, that will be reconsidering again so here you are having a black body for which irradiation is g and for black body you are knowing absorptivity is 1 and here we are considering it as a opaque so tau equal to 0 then the reflectivity is also 0 means nothing is being reflected then remaining thing is only the emitted energy since you are considering a black surface the emitted energy will be eb so here radiosity j will be equal to eb means for black surface the uh, emissive radiosity will be equal to emitted energy and the net energy leaving the surface net energy leaving will be equal to radiosity that is going energy is j or eb eb into a minus net energy coming is g irradiation into area so this will be or you can write eb minus g into a will be the net energy exchange uh, from a surface for a black body for a real body the net energy leaving will be this expression you can find this expressions in this uh, data book or uh, hmd data book i'll be showing this so in your data book you can see all these things yesterday we have discussed uh, last video we have discussed planck's law wayne's law stefan boltzmann law and again now kirchhoff law equal to the uh, emissivity will be equal to absorptivity which is given here and this uh, expression energy leaving this gray bodies from this surface just now that we have derived which is net energy the net energy leaving will be equal to epsilon into eb minus g into a divided by 1 minus epsilon same expression is given also here q equal to epsilon divided by rho rho can be considered as 1 minus alpha and according to kirchhoff law alpha equal to 1 minus epsilon that's how we are getting 1 minus epsilon in the denominator here remaining things are a into eb minus j same expression is given here also where j is the radiosity and expression for radiosity is also given j equal to reflected energy rho into g plus emitted energy which is epsilon into eb so this is all about radiosity thank you